GLP-1 drugs like Ozempic are being used for a lot more than weight loss, and that could lead to some problems for patients and insurers. Some of these drugs have been found to lower the risk of everything from Alzheimer's to addiction to sleep apnea, seizures, and bacterial infections. But there are still a lot of unknowns. The FDA has only approved GLP-1s for obesity, type 2 diabetes, heart risk, and under certain circumstances, sleep apnea. That means using them for any other condition is considered off-label and at the physician's discretion. And that designation can affect whether insurers pay for treatments. Plus, at over $1,000 a month, GLP-1s are driving up costs in the health system. Drug supply shortages and patchwork health plan coverage policies have made GLP-1s less available to patients most in need, including those in marginalized communities. And while the drugs have enormous promise, they do come with significant side effects, including increased risk for gastrointestinal disorders, low blood pressure, kidney stones, and pancreatitis. 